Good morning, guys. It is National Historic Places Day, and uh, it's pretty cool. We were asked by the Petroleum Discovery Foundation to come dig at their old uh, 1800s oil field property. So hopefully we can find some relics to give back to the museum. So uh, stick around and check it out. Other ones. This is a. I won't get into that one. That one's a packer. That's the guts of them packers I was telling you about. And there's hemp that's all on here and tied on. And this telescopes down. So when the, you put that at the bottom of the hole, the weight of the tubing on top pushes this in and it squishes all that hemp in. And that seals the water. Mr. Irvin, are you on the goods? I got something here, I don't know what it is. Kinda neat, bud. It looks like a T, like it was off of a, had a name there of some sort. I'm thinking sort. that, but. Huh. It's not, it's not steel, it's not iron. It looks like white metal almost. It does. Huh, super cool. Yeah. Mr. Ben, how's the digging going, my friend? A lot of junk in the ground. <laughs> yeah. Anything good? Nothing good so far. Oh. A lot of fragments. We'll catch up with you later. Good Let's see what you got. London Motor Products. I don't know what that would be, but pretty cool local history.
Mr. Bruce with a good signal on the Equinox. It's like a button. So sweet. That's the find of the day right there. Nice. Excellent hunt, buddy. Thanks. It does. How's the hunt going? Slow moving. Nice. <laughs> well, good luck. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, what do we have there? Um, I don't know, it's not iron. It's white metal of some kind. Some kind of mechanism. It's a bomb, run. Looks like a control panel from a button or something, yeah. Kind of like an ignition switch, maybe? Huh. And that other piece I dug up probably goes with it. Yeah, very cool. Yeah, sweet digging. Well, after sweating through my first shirt, I uh, put down the detector. I'm just cruising around, catching some video of everybody, and uh, hopefully we can uh, get something really cool on film. Uh, I'm just trying to track down Mr. Joe Bourgeois right now and uh, see what he's got. So, catch you soon. <laughs> Mr. Joe Bourgeois. There it is. Come oh, on, baby. Be nice. Oh, it's a penny. <laughs> Shit, <and> modern penny. <laughs> there it is, a modern penny. <laughs> like yeah, 10 inches down. down. a long way. See the bugger. Yeah. Look at that lousy penny. <laughs> Oh, it looks like Aaron's got something pretty cool. <laughs> hold on, hold on. You want to think so? So this uh, this pop tab must be from the early 1800s. Oh! <laughs> but it's actually the tree roots grown right through it, so she's like shanked right in there. Here, like it's oh, the video went yeah, shit. grew right in. That is pretty cool. Mr. Steve Bennett with the Equinox 800. I'll show you how to find a penny here. <laughs> That's how it's done, folks. There it is. Just the like penny that. of all pennies. Oh, I was trying to scare you, my friend. <laughs> what you got? I don't know. Man, it is a scorcher out here today. Like, unbelievably warm in the sun. Everyone's just starting to stick over to those shady spots now. I'm just uh, cruising around, you know, filming everybody. I didn't really get to detect too much today on my own, but, you know, that's how it goes. I'd rather make a cool video for you guys to watch. And, uh, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed it. And, uh... Have a good one. Hi, I'm Liz Welsh from Petroleum Discovery. We are so happy to welcome the Southern Ontario Diggers here. Have a dig on the property and find some relics from our oil history past. Things that may have fallen out of oil men's pockets or items that were discarded in their hunt for black gold. Come on out to Petroleum Discovery. Join us August the 10th or September the 28th from 10 till 4 for tours of our historic oil site. Thank you.